schematic views are generated fully automatically from 3D model of the installation. By configuring day to of starting point, the scope and detail of descriptions presented in the schematic view, can be defined. Depending on the data, available for the building, the heights of subsequent stories can be entered directly or they may result from the elevations of individual stories. These two data are interrelated, editing the height, automatically updates the elevation of the next story, and vice versa, changing the elevation affects the height of the story below. The rooftop elevation can be additionally defined for the last floor. A new diagnostic message has been added in the building structure calculations, overlapping or incorrectly connected walls occur. The contested elements are highlighted in the graphic editor, making it easier to find incorrectly made wall connections in the project. Analysis of completeness and correctness of the building structure is facilitated by a new option of differentiating the graphic presentation of a room drawn manually, from the automatically generated by the function, generate walls and slabs from rooms and building contour. The graphic presentation of the source element, has been supplemented with new variants, a hanging or standing boiler. If, as a result of laying the loop with a constant spacing, an empty space remains in the center, it can be left, or filled with a spacing smaller than specified. The filling mechanism can be controlled at the level of general data, or in the data table of the selected heating and cooling zone. In case of need of correction automatically generated loop drawings, the drawing grid and auto mode are useful. Grid evenly covers the entire heating and cooling zone. The distance between big grid points is consistent with the distance calculated by the program for the zone, which makes it easier to keep a constant distance for the loop being laid. Depending on the zoom level of the view, when you draw or move loop segments, the auto mode snaps segments to big or small grid points. In addition, it is possible to align the drawing grid to any edge of the zone.
Thanks to the new option, arrange panels with offset, available for the element, zone of ceiling panels, it is possible to automatically arrange ceiling panels in accordance with common practice, that is with mutual offset of subsequent rows of panels.